We are starting our Hollywood hike. Fake news. There's legit a coyote. Well, in LA, do as the LA Ians do. Hey guys, good morning. It's June 23rd. It is currently 6:10 a.m. and we are about to get picked up for the Hollywood hike. We're eating some toast. Um and, you know, I'm kind of scared because I just don't like to exercise first of all. Secondly, the last time I went on the hike, they said it wasn't going to be that bad, but I honestly felt like I was going to die. Like but the, it was mother who lied. It, it was like this straight up, like so steep. That's what they're doing again. They're like telling me that it's not gonna be that bad. I have a feeling they're lying. My grandma is so trendy. She has like a hydro flask because I asked for an extra water bottle for my sister. And she like said, oh, I don't have a water bottle, but I have a hydro flask or like a flask. We are starting our Hollywood hike. You'll see the sign up there. Yeah. And there oh, it's right there. Well, yeah. right there, you can't see it, but. Um, and then we go up Mulholland Drive. Yeah. We basically just gotta walk up all these neighborhood streets that we can't drive through because they get annoyed, <laughs> which is a little rude and selfish if you ask me. Uh -huh. okay. I'm already out of breath. <laughs> <laughs> Not even a Literally two steps. <laughs> In the distance is the sign. So cool. Oh, There's shoot. legit a coyote. Honestly, I'm not down. Oh my god. Okay, let's just let's just go this way. <laughs> Fake news. More fake news. Out here doing a photo shoot. I have no guilt because you know we did some hard work coming up here, so we deserve yeah, a photo we shoot. We made it. These flowers against this like white brick is so pretty. I love that. And I love how the sky is like just blue. It's yeah, blue. no clouds. So, did you think the Hollywood sign was overrated? I thought it was really cool. We saw a coyote on the way, and yeah, now it's all downhill. It's all downhill. No, literally. We <laughs> peaked. Literally. We literally <laughs> peaked. It still it looked beautiful. like a postcard. Like when I went to the Golden Gate Bridge, it still mm -hmm. looks like a postcard. Like even. It looks like a backdrop. Yeah. Like a it doesn't backdrop. look real. I'm glad it cleared up though, because this morning it was foggy, but. Yeah, we need a. Watch our every move. But I think that's really coyotes. funny because like all the signs were like don't go and then there's this tour guide who's like, oh, oh yeah, come on guys. And he was like leading a pack of like 20 people and I'm like, more than okay, that. well, yeah, it was a little more. So Anjali informed us that the neighborhood people, you wanna tell them? So the people who live by the sign uh -huh. in Beechwood, um, like the neighborhood, because they because they get annoyed of tourists and like just us. hikers just coming yeah, up, up in their neighborhood. Um, so yeah, so they put fake signs along the way that say like "Do not enter," um, "Road ends," "No access to yeah, sign. no access to sign," thousand dollar fine, like all these things to scare people off. But they're all just fake, and you can actually fake just go. news. Yeah, <laughs> um, and then they also like when you put in Hollywood sign on like Google Maps and stuff, like it doesn't actually take you to sign, it takes you to the Griffith Observatory. Fake news. <laughs> so it's all just ways to like get people lost and not have people come up here, but you just have to not follow the signs and just keep walking. <laughs> You'll be fine. This is our current view right now. You see the Hollywood sign now. Earlier it was like too foggy to see, but there it is. And we're so high up. Everything's like really dusty because of the sand. So like my backpack, my pants, my shoes, all dusty. Oh well. I 
just been feeling super trendy, so I'm craving that Insta-worthy food. I asked, what do you guys feel like eating? And I'm expecting like the genre of food, like Italian. You know, sushi, <laughs> Italian, burgers. And she's like, I'm feeling like something trendy. Just something trendy. <laughs> Anything trendy, really. Okay. We're only in LA once, right? Oh, oh floss? Oh yeah, I know I do that. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> the new dance moves, kids. Yeah. <laughs> What did he say? You got it. <laughs> Another one in the casket. Well, in LA, do as the LAians do. LAians? LAians. But we are going to Toast Bakery That's what they call it. Um, because yeah. I've heard so much about it, you know, from all the YouTubers. So now I feel like a true YouTuber going to all these like cool places and stuff like that. I should got a chai latte. Because I'm allergic to coffee, I wish it was a regular latte. <laughs> I miss iced coffee so much. They gave her little mouse cookies, a little Nichu's cookie for my little Nichu. Oh my gosh. Poor guy. Aren't you wish this is a cactus? It might be a little. Guys, cacti don't play. I just punctured my bag. How rude. And I just bought a dress from Bloomingdale's. It was a lot cheaper than I thought it was gonna be. So it was like $24, it was awesome. <laughs> I've never ever seen these in person, but they're so pretty and so pigmented. Watch. Yeah. Whoa. Right, that was, wait, but that was pretty good, right? Yeah. I mean, that wasn't even that great of a swatch, but okay, wait. Let's see this one, because it's crazy. So it's a crazy one. No. One swipe. Bam. Insane. Damn. Mm -hmm. It looks even better in person, honestly. I would but like you legit know really, really not pretty. Uh oh. Yeah, the price. <laughs> So we are at Zara and this place is literally a madhouse. Like, it's a madhouse. Serena was my assistant. Mm -hmm. and she helped me pick out some stuff. Like, I would say these clothes are like that put together style. You know what I mean? Like, they just make them all put together. I mean, this one's like whatever, but like, get this one. And then I got one. What is this called? Um, what? Family? Yeah. Was it Wednesday? Wednesday. Mm -hmm. Wednesday Mm hmm So I did get another dress for the convention. It reminds me of like Wednesday and then also do you remember Madeline? Oh yeah, mm -hmm. that's true. Yeah. So and they're having literally the biggest sale ever. I've never seen things on mm -hmm. biggest sale. Everyone's going crazy. <laughs> People are in line are being mean. Yep. <laughs> So that's when you know. So we are home and I just plugged my phone in because it was dead and Mama made us chai tea. It is chai, but you don't say chai tea. You're Ooh. brown. Ooh, I'm not brown apparently. White cousin! <laughs> Tell me these don't look like straight up grandma cookies. So I'm gonna do a really quick haul. So first I want to reveal what I got from Sephora. So I actually just use this on my face because I just looked a little washed out. I needed something on my face. So this is um, a bronzer, actually just kidding, matte perfection powder foundation. Um, so I actually use this for a contour. If you're my color, go look at this one. It is insanely pigmented. It is in the color Mocha Java. So that is what I bought at Sephora, but then I got this as like my free little sample because I have so many points. I just get like a 100.1 every time I go. So this is the Confidence in a Cream It Cosmetics Transforming 
moisturizing super cream and I am obsessed with all things hydrating because I have really dry skin so I thought it would be cool to test this out and it's always so nice to have just like a little container for moisturizer so you don't have to bring them around like your big um, pot of cream you know anywhere you go especially for like traveling so then from Bloomingdale's I didn't show you guys this dress I don't think originally it was 88 but then it said now 44 and then I got to the register and it was 24 so that was awesome not sure if you can see it but it's just like kind of like a slimming dress it's a little bit long but not extremely long and probably by this time you've seen my shop with me for professional clothing vlog so the hunt is still going on um, I think it has finally ended, but I still want to buy some shoes, like some really nice flats that actually like have a strap around the ankle or something like that. Because the problem with the flats I have now is that it like comes off my heel when I walk. But then I also want to go to Charming Charlie's because I have a gift card and I have been dying to get these tassel earrings. Like you guys don't even know. I've been seeing them everywhere and I just really want like really nice white tassel earrings because they actually sent me the tassel earrings but they were like multicolored which were cute but like I want the white ones for a certain dress that I have already. Then for Zara like I said it was a madhouse in there like it was crazy I've never seen <laughs> Zara like that. It was basically like Black Friday. So the first piece that I got it's a really flowy top and it has yellow accents. Highlighter yellow so that's kind of cool. And honestly, when I put it on, I felt like a pirate because it's just like that piratey feel. Um, it's very comfortable. I got it in a size like large or something. Extra large, actually. Oops. I just like my clothes bigger on me just because it makes me look better. Like if it's not tight, it would be a cute beach cover up or just like a nice tunic over some jeans. Then I got this green top. It's like a long sleeve button down. I think it is kind of long enough for a dress, but I think I'm just going to wear it as a tunic just to be safe. Or maybe like with shorts and like tuck some of it in, I have the vision. So this is another dress for the convention and it reminds me of like Wednesday from the Adams Family. Just like a basic white collared dress. I think this dress would be really cute with some statement earrings. The last thing I got, I was obsessed with when I saw it um, and I thought it was gonna be like my favorite thing that I got from Zara, but it wasn't just cause like, I guess it didn't fit like perfectly, but I still got it just because it's one of those tops that if you see on someone, you're like, oh my god, she has her life together. Like, I want to be like her. I want to dress cute like her. It's like that pink color that everyone's obsessed with. It's a little bit darker in person. It kind of looks like white pink on camera, but basically has all these like frills and stuff like that. And, like, so are you having fun in California? I'm having so much fun. And today I was craving like something really cheesy all day. <laughs> and then our grandparents just bought us pizza <laughs> and it just came to me magically. By my grandparents. Honestly, it's so weird because like he was like, oh, I'll get like Papa John's or whatever. And I'm like, oh, wait, what? What's happening? Because I feel like adults just like, oh, eat healthy. Like, like here's some spinach and chicken curry. I don't know. Look at these really cute earrings I got from Boohoo. They were super cheap because it was like a 50% off sale at the time. So, and I think it's still going on. Like, I swear that site is so weird. They have this horrible torturing marketing like scheme that they say like oh 50 percent off it ends in 45 minutes when you're on the site and then literally you'll check back like a day later and it says the same thing so they literally probably say like it's 50 percent off like every hour just to make you like hurry up and buy things it really just hurts the heart because i literally thought i wasn't gonna make it for the sale but i mean hey I am not complaining about a 50% off sale, so keep it up, boohoo. Not like, what the? Oh, is that exciting? Like, it looks like a makeup. Who's a girl? You woke up just in time, Bubba. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this is what I got. Oh, you got a dress? Yeah, it's a dress. Oh, oh my gosh. Hey, you want to see yourself? Yeah. Look. Yeah. Look, is that you? <laughs> yeah, oh, say yeah. yeah. What's your name? What's your name? Hi. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> My uncle's backyard is so nice. Gold.
It looks like Kona Grill. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.